In this video I'm going to talk about the uh, default uh, subheader options. Now as you, as you know uh, the subheader is uh, this top part that's uh, right uh, after the header. Uh, it usually contains uh, the titles, uh, the breadcrumb and the current date. Now uh, you can assign a default uh, subheader for uh, the entire uh, website and afterwards you can uh, define uh, custom, st uh, custom styles but as a ground base there must be uh, a default one. Now you can uh, select an image, you can uh, choose a background image for it, you can uh, change the background color. can uh, provide different uh, styles like uh, adding a gradient over the color this will make uh, a dark gradient which uh, now this is a bit tricky because uh, the header also has a gradient here at the top but the subheader subheader uh, gradient is uh, right uh, at the bottom. Now you can also have uh, an animated header, it will uh, add uh, an animation for it, for example. This is uh, nice to have uh, on uh, an image which is, uh, I don't know, looks great with uh, this kind of animation then we have a glare effect as you can see here this is a glare effect these are nice uh, things uh, to have perhaps uh, you don't really want them they're good to be there. It depends on uh, what you want to, to display. You can also select a few uh, uh, styles for the bottom part, for example, a shadow up and down. As you can see here, there's a shadow here and also here. Uh, it's good to separate uh, uh, two blocks. You can uh, also hide the breadcrumbs and the date here. And of course you can uh, also toggle the display for the page title and the page subtitle. These two. Also you can uh, set a custom height depending uh, on what you want. By default uh, the subheader has a height of uh, 300 uh, pixels which is uh, let's say decent but perhaps you want something custom so you can uh, adjust, this, adjust it as you want to. Now like I said this uh, default subheader usually um, is uh, is the default one. I mean, like I said, you can uh, have a custom uh, subheader, subheaders here in the unlimited uh, subheaders uh, section of the Kalia option. And you, in the page builder, you also have a custom element which uh, you can uh, customize as much as you want with uh, all these options and also uh, videos or or videos. So um, for the moment uh, these are the options for the default subheader. Uh, we'll uh, talk. I will talk about uh, uh, the unlimited uh, subheaders options a bit later. So it would be better if you can, uh, if you're interested in this part, you can uh, look at uh, both uh, videos. Now, uh, like I said, uh, if you're having problems, don't hesitate to 
uh, go to our support forums and uh, start a new topic there and uh, our team will uh, will assist you so thanks for watching bye